Introducing the horses, race number 10. Race 10 is the second division, fifth leg for two-year-old fillies and Ohio sires. Racing one mile, a purse of $16,000. The one is a daughter of Rocky Bogart. Oh, by Tanya and Ted Parker, Valeria, Ohio, Joe Asig, the trainer. A raceway park record of 158 and four. She has earnings of over $17,000. Coming in from Northfield Park, Baroque Bogart with Joe Asig, Jr. The two is a daughter of Towner's big guy, owned by Mike Bardo of Bradford Dan Purdue Training, with a side of downs record of 159 and 3. With earnings of over $19,500, Eric Ledford driving Peekaboo Sage. The three is also a daughter of Towner's big guy, owned by Dennis Sheehan of New Wilmington, Pennsylvania. Mark Deaton is the trainer. A mark at Northfield Park of 201. Earnings of $4,900. Steve Carter driving Kelly's hat trick. The four is a daughter of Noble Land Sam. Oh, by Gerald Goldberg of Pepper Pike, Ohio. Gary Martin trains. A, re a record of 158 and 1. Earnings of $33,000. Brent Holland driving Missy America. Post five going to a, a daughter of Noble and Sam, owned by Shirley and Janet Bay, Martin and Shelley Polly of Ohio, Ron Potter, the trainer, with earnings of over $9,000. She comes in from Northfield Park. Dave Miller driving, Noble Marty. Number six, a daughter of Rocky Bogart, owned by Philip Boloff, Martin Yoder, and Angela Oliverio of Ohio. John Oliverio is the trainer. She, with a record of 157 and 2, has earned over $33,000. Today, she's driven by Don Irvine Jr. The six is Rocky Surf. A bay daughter of Jerry U2, owned by Ann Kirk of Lockburn, Ohio, Tom Brinkerhoff, the trainer. A record at Croton on the county fair track, 204 and 1, earnings of over $10,700. From post seven, it's Scootin' Anne with Jeff out. From post eight, a daughter of Sandman Hanover, owned by Sherry and Stan Cox at Avar, Ohio. Scott Cox, the trainer. She just comes off a lifetime best of 159 in Ohio Sires at Northfield Park. She's made over $22,500. She's driven by Scott Cox. She is Strawberry Shrake. And the nine is a daughter of Tucson Hanover, owned by Magic Touch Incorporated, and Brian Robbins, Richard Crown of Ohio, Don Baroff Training. With a mark of 158 and two, earnings of over $5,000 from post nine, C Spray, and Larry Stolbaugh. One play show, perfect to try, fact to wagering. Six minutes to post time, six minutes. Two year old Philly Pacers lining up, moving in. On the back stretch, there they go. And uh, they're off, and from the far outside, Strawberry Shrake is hustled away, but from the inside, Peekaboo Sage quickly takes command. Kelly's hat trick, him away strong from the inside, off the rail, Baroque Bogart is now third. Around the first turn, Sea Spray was sent out early, but is now caught three wide. At the rail is Missy America. Slipping up quickly into the pocket comes Noble Marty. On the inside in uh, eighth, as they round the first turn, Rocky Surf, the early trailer racing in ninth, Scootin' Annie. Opening quarter, a very quick 26 and four. Out of the outside, here comes Baroque Bogart, and Essig putting Baroque Bogart right to the front end. Uh, Peekaboo Sage on the inside will give it up for cover in second. At the rail in third is Kelly's hat trick. Parked to the outside fourth, Strawberry Shrake. Inside and racing five, Missy America. To the outer flow and sick now comes Noble Marty. Sea Spray has found a seat, is saving ground here. Seventh out the rail. To the outside and eighth is Rocky Surf. The trailer is Scoot Nanny. The half 56 and two as they zip to the backside. And it's Baroque Bogart. She leads here a length. Kelly's hat trick now to the outside. First up and she makes her bid for the lead. And Carter is putting Kelly's hat trick to the test of the outside. But she cannot clear Baroque Bogart. And these two are slugging it out. Now they're four across. And here comes a Rocky Surf. And Rocky Surf 
right on by here. Rocky Surf, what a big move, has taken the lead. Three quarters, 126 and one. And Irvine coming from nowhere here was eighth, is now on top and is up by five. And Rocky Surf has taken the lead here. She is drawing clear. Inside now, racing a second is Baroque Bogart as they drive for the payoff. Rocky Surf is tiring badly, but has enough of a jump here. It's Rocky Surf who is coasting home. Baroque Bogart is staggering second. Here comes Missy America. Rocky Surf in 156 and three over Miss America and uh, Baroque Bogart. Well, here, ladies and gentlemen, is the official winner, the second final division, the fifth and final leg of Ohio Sires. Coming from well off the pace this afternoon, a daughter of Rocky Bogart. Number six is Rocky Surf. Owned by Philip Baldoff, Martin Yoder, and Angela Oliveri of Ohio. She was bred by Bill Brewer of Virginia. Trained by John Oliverio and nicely handled this afternoon by Don. Irvine Jr. What a big move from Rocky Surf for her sixth career win and only nine starts and a lifetime best now, 156 and a three fifths. For driver Don Irvine Jr., two wins this afternoon. Well, ladies and gentlemen, trackside now is the to make the tri trophy presentation, a longtime owner and breeder and breeder of many Ohio Sires champions. Tracks how to make that trophy presentation is Doris Steeman. And Doris Steeman today is celebrating her birthday. Happy birthday from everyone here at Cider Downs to Doris Steeman.